Hand. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. You currently have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the upside. You've got the Dow up 112 points, 3 tenths percent. S&P a half a percent or 22. NASDAQ 8 tenths, 127 points, 1 and 3 quarters percent for the Russell 2000. 35 points to the upside. Semis are up about 7 tenths or 23 points. Gold is off 25 bucks. That's down 1 and a quarter percent. Silver is off 1 and 7 tenths or 42 cents trading out at 2477 lights recruit off three bucks 10283 is the print there natural gas down nine cents and the 30-year treasury is up one tick one and a half uh, points out there trading out at 14903 let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart we begin by taking a look at the es mini the es mini Today should be the uh, td9 count top we'll complete the pattern today if we see a close above uh, today's high tomorrow or really the next day, that'll tell us about a strong momentum move to the upside. But other than that, uh, today should be, we should begin to see a top and a price pull back to about the 44, 38-ish type area out there. If we take a look at the uh, spot volatility index, it says, hey, I don't even know what you guys are talking about. I'm below the 50-day exponential moving average and continue to head lower. That is always a bullish condition for the S&P 500. The NQ also in the bar following bar number nine, so it should complete a TD9 count top. Price should pull back to test support, maybe in the 14 326 level out there. I don't know that we've gotten a signal just yet. In fact, I'm certain that we don't have a signal just yet uh, that uh, that's going to come to fruition, meaning the top. We'll take a look at that during the Trader's Edge show. The U.S. dollar index is consolidating with inside its daily profile, at least its old profile out there. The uh, uh, Right now, I've got the June contract. We're rolling from April to June. Price has pulled back and tested the uh, swing point. The swing point that I'm referring to is from March 16th. As long as that holds on the June contract, that's 1900 and uh, 40 cents out there. Silver also testing a swing point and rejecting it. That's at the 24.55 level. The importance of those swing points is they could, if we did see it close below those levels, signal an A to B equals CD to the downside. That is not the pattern that we have in place as we speak right now. Lights Recruit is trading below the bottom of its daily profile. This would be day number two, so may retarget its most recent low, although it's really tested the top of that and is rejected. That's March 15th level that we're taking a look at. Natural Gas attempting to form a new daily profile. I was supported $5.06 and resistance, 561 in the 30-year Treasury trying to regain the bottom of its daily profile. If it does close above 148.07, could signal move up to the 151.21 level. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. If you're off to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you again soon.